Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with a new Dollar Tree haul for this week. I do have a ton of pictures that I will include at the end, so please be sure to stay tuned. So this is a very short haul. I picked up a few items to complete some Easter baskets and I will be doing videos on those soon. Honestly, I did not realize how late in the month of April Easter was. Uh, I don't know if I'm the only one that picked up on that, but Easter isn't until like the, the 20th or the 21st of April. So we still have plenty of time, even though the Dollar Tree has already put out all of their Easter stuff. So I did pick up a lot of goodies and knickknacks and things to include two Easter baskets that I'm making this year. So the first thing I picked up, uh, and a lot of these things, well not a lot, it's like half sugar-free and half not sugar-free. The first thing I picked up is the sugar-free Chico Stick or Chico Stick. Crunchy peanut butter and toasted coconut candy made in the USA. This is 2.25 ounces. So I did grab that. And then I also picked up some of these sugar-free fruit chews. So you get orange, strawberry, and peach. And you also get lemon. So these probably taste pretty good. So it's a low-fat food made in the USA. And this is 2.75 ounces. Got that. And then I also got, now this looks pretty good. I might go back and pick up another one of these. This is a bag of the Laffy Taffy and it's in the flavors orange sor sorbet and lemon raspberry. You get 12 bars and this is 4.2 ounces. So that, you know, that uh, raspberry sounds pretty good. That orange sorbet sounds good too, even though I typically don't like orange flavors. I also picked up some of the sweet tarts. You get them in the shapes chicks, ducks, and bunnies. And it looks like it just comes in three flavors. Um, I don't like the blue raspberry, maybe a lemon flavor, and maybe strawberry. I'm not quite sure about the sweet tart flavors, but this bag is 4.5 ounces. So you get chicks, ducks, and bunnies. I also picked up some of the M&Ms in the milk chocolate. Uh, this particular container is 3.10 ounces. And then I also picked up this Russell Stover peanut butter covered in milk chocolate and it's uh, a bunny rabbit. So a couple more food items. I also picked up this Godiva Masterpieces dark chocolate ganache heart. I think that's what that says. G-A-N-A-C-H-E. And this is 0 0.8 ounces. So that looked pretty good and it's dark chocolate. And I also picked up these truffles. It says premium milk chocolate with caramel filling and it's two ounces and it is a four pack. So this is a repurchase for me. This is the Tony Saturated Creole Foods Dirty Rice Mix and it is five ounces. It says microwave or stove top. I have to tell y'all the last time I picked this up, probably about two or three weeks ago now, we made up a box of this. We put some breakfast sausage in it, cooked up some breakfast sausage and it was very good. I would suggest eating this probably, um, you know, it could be a whole meal to be honest. You don't just have to use that as a side. You could put some green, green beans or some broccoli with it on the side, or you can do like Bojangles or KFC or something like that. And, you know, make some kind of chicken, have a vegetable and then have this on the side with it as well. This is pretty good. So we did pick up two more boxes of this. And like I said, it is a five ounce box of the dirty rice. I also grabbed a box, not a box, we grabbed a bag of the Utz Kettle Classics. This is the smoking Sweet Barbecue Flavor, and this is the Crunchy Potato Chip. It says Spicy Heat with a Kiss of Sweet, Cooked Kettle Style in Peanut Oil, and this is 2.625 ounces. This is actually good. I've ate a bag of them. We picked up two bags, and it has a very nice flavor to it, and these are like Kettle Style Chips. And the last food item that I have, a lot of food items this week, uh, a lot of like junky type food items to complete those Easter baskets. But the last item I picked up is Crayola brand fruit snacks. And it says 100% DV vitamin C, fat free, no high fructose corn syrup and cholesterol free. And this is 4.8 ounces. It comes with six patches in there. Did go ahead and open it up just so I could show y'all show what a pack looks like. That's pretty much all that you get. It comes in this clear plastic and then you have the little gummies there. The gummies are kind of tough to chew on, I will say. So I think I know maybe why they're at the Dollar Tree. But hey, if you know, if you like tough gummies, if that's your thing, then go ahead and pick up a box of these. I grabbed some more of my soft soap value refills. This is just the antibacterial hand soap and the refills are 11.25 fluid ounces. So I did grab two more of these just to fill the soap containers around the house. 
This was a new item at the particular Dollar Tree I went to. Um, this is honestly an area specific item and you'll see why in a second. It's two notebooks and they say North Carolina Tar Heels. So I grabbed one for me and one for my mom. I know that she would really like it. And I'm sure they have about, uh, it says one subject notebook, 80 perforated uh, sheets and they're college ruled five inches by seven inches. So I grabbed two of these little tablets. Now I did see this on the Dollar Tree Facebook group. I'm in that group and I saw someone haul this. Um, I'm not quite sure if it's new or not. It may have been at the Dollar Tree a little while, but I decided I wanted to go ahead and pick this up. It's the Yardley London brand, and this is the activated charcoal soap. It's 4.25 ounces. They actually sell this brand at Walmart for a lot cheaper than a dollar. I think it's like 78 cents or something. It's really cheap. It's with bentonite clay to help cleanse and purify skin. So I wanted to give this a try and see how I like it. I also grabbed this Sassy and Chic 2-in-1 foot file. I actually got two of these. I love that it has a little handle to it. And they only had this green color available. And then I also grabbed this. This is actually from one of the Easter baskets. And it's like a combination of like a foot file. Just a little manicure pedicure set. You get a little nail brush. Some little um, some nail files. Looks like some little cuticle things. And the things that you put between your toes. And it's in the color purple. So I did grab that for a basket. This items they had by the register. Like in the little impulse section. And this is the uh, it's a two pack of eyeglass cleaning cloths. And it says durable microfiber reusable pouches. And I did pick this up. So the first one is a black. And then when you flip it. It's like this purple color. So obviously I have glasses. And I like to make sure they're clean. Next, I picked up this E-Circuit screen cleaning set. You get a cleaning solution and a cleansing cloth. And it says great for cleaning TVs, laptops, cameras, and phones. I recently purchased a new iPad for myself for my birthday. My birthday is on Friday and I'll be 28. So I wanted to treat myself to something. And I needed to get um, just a cloth to keep the iPad clean. I have a case for it, but I wanted to get one of these as well. The last couple of items that I got are like stationary type of items. These were new and I have to tell y'all, y'all know I'm a planner girl. I'm addicted to planners and stationery and pens and all of that stuff. This is such a good deal. This is the Uniball brand, which is a very good brand as far as pens are concerned. And they are the Uniball gel pens, 0 0.7 millimeter medium tip, bold vibrant ink. And each of these has a two pack of pens. And in this set, you get the uh, purple pen and you get green. So this is such a good deal, y'all. And then this one, you get blue and pink. So I did pick these up. I was so surprised to see these at the Dollar Tree. I couldn't believe it. And Uniball is a very smooth writing pen. So if you see these, grab them all if you're into pens. And the last couple of things I picked up are actually these poster stickers. My first time seeing these, I went into one of my normal Dollar Trees that I go into. They had completely reorganized it because they're putting in a snack zone. So they had everything. It was just so nice in there. And I was able to find these. So this first one I picked up is um, and they're peel and stick and they're great for event signs, school projects and home decor projects. So obviously I can incorporate these in planner things if I want to make customized covers, whatever I want to make. That's what I got it for. So this one is a 15 count of the Starburst. So that's what that one looks like and have it on the front and the back. And then this one is the six borders. They're border stickers, but I love that they're like, you know, polka dots and dots within each other. I think that's really cute. I don't necessarily have to use them as borders if I want to take some of my punches, my craft punches, and punch out little uh, shapes or whatever. I could do that as well. The next one is labels. So it's 15 uh, labels, like in different sizes. This would be good, you know, if you're sending packages or anything like that. And it's front and back. The next one is 56 characters, so they're just letters of the alphabet in different colors, and they're kind of pastel looking colors, and they've got like an outline to them. And the next one is 56 characters again, and it's just black letters. So I thought that was a good deal, especially again, if I'm making customized planner covers, if I want to put my name on it, or if I make one for somebody, I don't know, I can use this as well. So that was everything that I picked up this week at the Dollar Tree. Um, I should have did this haul days ago, y'all, but things just got in the way of it and I wasn't able to get it done. So I do apologize for that. I will be heading back to the Dollar Tree in a couple of days and I should have another haul up by Monday, Sunday or Monday, sometime in between that. 
I also will be uh, doing my birthday giveaway video. I try to do a giveaway. The last couple of years I've been on YouTube, every birthday, you know, before, during, or around the birthday, around my birthday time, I try to do a giveaway. So that one is coming up. So stay tuned for that. I hope that y'all are having a great day whenever you see this video. And I'll talk to you again in my next one. Bye.